DJS Associates is a natural fit for historical preservation projects with our vast experience, proven best practices, and leading edge technology. This combination is essential to precisely memorialize significant national and international treasures. DJS is honored to be an official partner of SciArc, a nonprofit dedicated to protecting the world's heritage for digital preservation and educational purposes. Through our work with SciArc, we've accelerated our experience in historical preservation in a relatively short period of time. The key to historical preservation is striving for comprehensive documentation without compromising the integrity of the site. You don't know who will be using your data over time or for what purpose, so you can't leave any stone unturned. Students across the world may be learning about history and want to know more about our national treasures. Or a preservation architect could be studying how or why a historical structure was built for current applications. Our historical preservation clients include architects, government agencies, and consultants working on new developments next to or near historical buildings. Many of our clients want us to collect the data and deliver the 3D point cloud. Others, such as architects who aren't familiar with working with scan data, will ask us to deliver a BIM model. Either way, we work fast. Our state-of-the-art equipment, like our long and short-range high-definition laser scanners and our drones, remove the possibility of measurement errors that could push a project over budget or behind schedule. The Lincoln Memorial in Washington, D.C. is certainly awe-inspiring, but surprisingly, I thought the coolest part of our documentation effort was the basement. There I was, standing in a place that the general public never gets to experience, surrounded by hundreds of columns. Through our work, now anyone across the globe can experience it virtually, just as I did firsthand. I'm excited about DJS's potential to share world heritage in this way. How cool would it be to virtually explore Versailles or an 800-year-old castle in Scotland as if you were really there?